Hello friends! Welcome to my YouTube channel. Before we start, please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell icon. Thanks! The royal family are bracing themselves for bombshells from the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's Netflix documentary as it streams across the world on Thursday morning. Harry and Meghan's Netflix documentary could be very uncomfortable for the Princess of Wales by focusing on the early days of her relationship with William and revisiting a notorious row she had with Meghan, a royal expert said today. A new trailer released yesterday gave the strongest signal, yet that the Sussexes will seek to reopen old wounds as they seek to justify Megxit, with Harry claiming they suffered from leaks and planted stories that backed up the royal family hierarchy. In a trailer for the series, Harry has warned, we know the full truth, and spoken of a hierarchy in the family, a dirty game and leaking and planting of stories. The pair looks set to outline Meghan's treatment by the press, challenge allegations the Duchess bullied staff, and seemingly delve into their relationships with the royals in the household. The Sussexes signed lucrative deals thought to be worth more than £100 million with Netflix and Spotify after quitting the monarchy amid the Megxit crisis as they struggled with royal life. They plunged the monarchy into crisis with their bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey in March 2021, while the Duke of Edinburgh was in hospital. Asked about reports the palace will respond to any controversial claims which might emerge, Ms. Schofield said, This is a really slippery slope. I know the palace will handle this with care. If a claim is so outrageous, perhaps an official response would shut it down. However, I suspect that accusations will be proven false with strategic suggestions to respected media outlets in the form of whispers and slash or former members of staff coming out to refute claims. Do we expect William to hold a press conference? No. But might someone in his orbit point the media in the direction of a contradiction or proof of a fib? Maybe. She added, Harry and Meghan seem to lack the ability to recognize the consequences of their actions. William will fight fiercely for his birthright and the future of the monarchy. Harry's destructive behavior would be incredibly disappointing to their mother, Princess Diana. Anything we see that sways from palace protocol would be an extreme act of preserving the sanctity and the reputation of the family. A friend close to the royal family, who has not been named, has stressed the situation concerned real people and that there was a great deal of sadness involved. They said, it's really important to remember that these are real people. This isn't a soap opera. They are human beings in a family, and there's a great deal of sadness. Harry's father, King Charles, and brother William, along with Camilla and Kate, are not expected to personally watch the series, but royal aides are expected to be tasked with closely monitoring the output and considering, if at all, how to respond. The king and the royal family will be carrying on with royal duties as normal today, December 8, with the docuseries also coinciding with the first circulation of coins bearing Charles' effigy in post offices around the UK. Today, Jack Royston, chief royal correspondent at Newsweek, said the content of the trailer suggested the documentary would not just concern itself with recent events, but also delve into the more distant past, including the rocky early days of William and Kate's romance. He told Good Morning Britain, We've had Kate in both the trailers. In the most recent one, there's a strap line underneath, which is a headline from a magazine cover. That particular magazine included an allegation that the Queen was embarrassed of her and photographs of her drunk in public were on the front cover. So if they're going to go into the early days of Kate and William's relationship, that could be very uncomfortable. Mr. Royston also predicted Netflix would revisit a story from 2018 which claimed that Meghan made Kate cry when she unfavorably compared Princess Charlotte to her best friend's daughter during a bridesmaid thing. He added, In the Oprah interview that was described as a major turning point where everything changed, then in this latest Netflix trailer, you have Harry saying, This was the turning point. They don't say what he's talking about, but you kind of already know. The new trailer has sparked a furious backlash with royal sources insisting it was absolutely wrong to suggest Harry and Meghan had been briefed against and unprecedented steps had been taken to support them. So what do you think about this news, guys? Please, share your personal opinion with us in the comment section below.
Thank you.